Let's talk some tennis. Let's talk tennis. Let's talk tennis. Let's talk tennis. Last minute winner right there with three seconds to go. Yeah, you know, I've prepared a long time for this event. <laughs> oh, I lost all my confidence now for the tournament. <laughs> We are on the grounds for the US Open. Here we are at the BNP Paribas Open. Back at the Australian Open. Celebrity wheelchair basketball. All right, before the games begin, we have a press conference with all of the players. So what brings you here tonight, Landon? It's a good cause, it's a lot of fun. And I don't get out much, I got little kids, so it's a good time to get out. You're just raising kids, and just picking up kids from school, dropping them off? Professional data. I don't know, it's kind of looking like the odds may ever be in Fed's favor. I'm Carrie Fearman with Joel Drucker, and this is The Daily Mix. Williams' first set was entirely plagued by errors, finishing with 13 unforced errors, four double faults, and just a 38% first serve rate. Not good. Marty Fish, not on the tennis court where I normally see you. How did you do out there today? So I felt bad for them, so I let them win. That was really nice of you. You're, you're such a giving person. No sweat, ambassadors, unite. No sweat right here. I will not have a lick of sweat on my forehead. No, no sweat. No sweat. No sweat. No. I think you look pretty snazzy. I like it. I'm hosting Good Morning Football to where I got to wear a bunch of different outfits. So this is probably one of the outfits you're going to see me wearing on Good Morning Football. You can't double dip, Reggie. You can't do that. The one unusual thing about me is I'm left-handed, but I play golf right-handed. Interesting. But for the most part, I can just... It doesn't matter. Yeah. I can, I can hit it either hand. And he's like, I can just kill it any which way. It doesn't I matter. <laughs> Who was your fiercest competitor out there today? We just had fun. Something to compete. It, it gets the competitive juices flowing a little bit. So in 1969, Billie Jean King won Wimbledon, and she won 700 pounds, compared to Rod Laver, who won 2,000 pounds. We're bringing up the historical pay discrepancy, but at the same time, it still applies today. Serena! Rafa! Serena! Rafa! Just grab the right wheel. Only. I grab only the right wheel. Yep. Oh, hey! hey. I didn't win all the matches, but it was fun. And by the way, you played great. Thank you. Yeah, I think we succeeded. We won, we won it hard this year. Mm -hmm. like, you played insane this year. Uh, it, we won't, I'm sorry, how did, I, how did I play? Can you tell me one more time? Uh, I want you to have this time I saying it. I was the only one claiming you when you hit a bad shot. <laughs> I claimed it. I was like, that's my girl. Cheers. How many times a week do you get asked if you're a basketball player? <laughs> At least 10 times a day. You think that the Raiders are going to go to Super Bowl in three years? I'm telling you, in three years, they, they're going to be there. All right, well, in three years, I'm going to follow up with you. I'll be back here. Oh. We'll, we'll meet here three years from well, I will we'll see you three years from today, oh, right. right here. You, my dear, are the definition of a true queen. Every queen deserves a crown. Our king and queen of the court, Kerry Furman of Talk Tennis TV and Kay Nishikari. Hey, Talk Tennis, I'm Jeannie, and I'm here chilling with someone who's much prettier than me. Oh, right. I think there'd be a lot of guys in this world that would disagree. <laughs> Who are you most excited to see today? Jeannie. Oh, shocker. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I'm excited to see you. Ah, good answer. What do you do off the court that we don't know and don't hear about all of the time? <laughs> That's a good, great question. Um, <laughs> I'm about to have a baby girl in a month, so that, that, yeah. that's yeah. 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 I mean, We just got married after them, and uh, we just moved to a new house. So I've gotten really into uh, some ideas lately. <laughs> <laughs> the Quadro twist is the talk of the town. Look what I've got! I can throw a football properly. Powder puff? <laughs> no, 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 I played the voice. All right, we are here with Marcus Allen. Junior was such a bright light. Uh, he was one of my best friends. He called me big brother. Did you have fun out there today with the kids? Yes, I had really fun. It was really nice to see how the kids can enjoy. And pretty awesome that you get to work pretty with Tyler Perry. So because of that, like, I don't really sleep too much, and like, I won't work out too often. Um, Are you sure? <laughs> Did you guys see that guy score the winning bucket at the buzzer? My two favorite things collide today at the Miami Open: tennis and animals. Let's have some fun. Who wore this dress better, Caroline Wozniacki or? 
Roger Federer. <laughs> She's dressed for golf. Her name is Carrie Fearman. Oh! That's a wrap for the 20th Anniversary Celebrity Championship Golf Tournament. I'm Carrie Fairman. I'll see you guys next week. Toodaloo.